Get up! Now! Forcing Harry to live in the cupboard under the stairs, not feeding him much, the grabbing, the throwing, locking him in his room, even at night, burning his letters, all form of child abuse. Sorry about that. I demand that you leave at once, sir. You are breaking and entering. Dry up, Dursley, you great prune. <laughs> Under the castle doctrine, the Dursleys are permitted to use force to attempt to defend themselves against an intruder. Therefore, this is legal. You're never going back to that school. You're never going to see those freaky friends of yours again. Never! I'll make short work of this. Bombarda, Maxim! Ah! Is he ours anymore? And the pain stops after a while. Yeah. <laughs> Whether he wants to give them to me or not. Have you brought the Veritaserum? I'm afraid you've used up all my stores interrogating students. I've given you a choice, Potter. As this is an issue of ministry security, you leave me with no alternative. The Cruciatus curse ought to loosen your tongue. That's illegal. What Cornelius doesn't know won't hurt him. That was pretty close to the torture curse being inflicted on Harry. So close that Umbridge got her mouth in the cr sound position, about to utter the incantation. Is it close enough to charge? Uh, no. We got intent, but maybe she was bluffing. Maybe it was just to scare him. Who knows? Lower your weapons. Human intelligence. <laughs> yes. How dare you! Half-breed! Incautious! Definitely could be said that she went overboard here. However, the centaurs were the aggressors. Therefore, the blame for this encounter lays on them. For evaluation. But know this. You have nothing to fear if you have nothing to hide. <laughs> Under the Voldemort-controlled Ministry of Magic, Umbridge would sentence muggle-born witches and wizards in sham trials to Azkaban. According to JK Rowling, in a 2015 article, she got sentenced to life herself for this, so I will include that. I don't think you meant it to kill anyone, but... You can't. You don't understand. System Aperio! Aragog! I can't let you go. They'll have your one for this, Hagrid. You'll be expelled. Come on now, Harry. The niceties must be observed. Dumbledore wouldn't want you to forget your manners, would he? I said... Oh, that's better. No! We have confirmed.
confirmed that 10 high security prisoners in the early hours of yesterday evening did escape. <laughs> Who knows how to play? Itchy? Bitty? Baby? Potter? Poetry is strange. Those closest to him believe we have infiltrated the ministry. Well, they got that right then, didn't they? <laughs> For evaluation. Begin. He who must not be named raises an army and invades a school, causing a wizarding war. I'm gonna charge him with war crimes on the basis of him breaking the peace and causing the conflict over nothing but his want to rule everyone. Now what's missing? Ah yes. We have another wizarding war that happened before the events of Harry Potter, where we get confirmed that he tortured lots of people and killed them. In the past, it was often the Dark Lord's pleasure to invade the minds of his victims. After tonight, if they speak of you, they'll speak only of how you begged for death. And I, being a merciful... Only when he had them literally begging for death would he finally kill them. Death worth another death sentence in my books. <laughs> <laughs> 